Hello! Today I will be sharing about the new AppSheet database. As of today, it is still in preview mode, but it will be available officially soon. So, what's the difference? Here's what we know so far. For spreadsheet or Excel, formatting a spreadsheet for app creation can be time consuming. Changes to the data schema after initial app creation are challenging and can easily break apps. Unstructured data leaves room for human error in data entry. Scalability and sync speed starts to deter as sheet size increases. So, logically AppSheet database should behave the other way around. Let's have a look. At your main page in AppSheet, you'll see both apps and database at the top. To create your own AppSheet database, simply click on Create and select Database. Now a generic database has been created. Let's change the DB name first. You can easily rename it on your own and changing the table name. This is somewhat similar to Excel or Spreadsheet. So once you're done, here you can edit the column name, type, etc. as you normally do. I'll make some changes to demonstrate. You can delete columns and add columns easily. You can check on the config of your columns here. A summary row feature for each column. This is useful for data management. With the right data set, you'll be able to view a suitable layout for your database. From the AppSheet database, you can immediately create an app. Simply click on New AppSheet App and AppSheet will create a new app using your database. New app is created based on the data that we created earlier. And I hope you enjoyed this video. Do like and subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care. Bye bye.